and to them at the uh, Intercontinental Hotel in Sancton, Johannesburg, South Africa. And this is a club in the continent, Suite 1956. But let's start with the bath bathroom, oh my goodness. The, the bedroom. So, um, yeah, I came here quite late last night. Bed was extremely comfortable. Um, and of course you have a couple of chairs sitting around. TV here on the uh, bedroom as well. And I love the fact that they're using a uh, proper water. I mean, not that there is really a difference between the waters. But they use um, aquapanna um, as their complementary water. And another surprise, I didn't use this because I actually I showered in the, in the uh, fitness center. They use the um, uh, uh, Ferragamo line of bathroom amenities, Tuscan Soul. Um, and see, so they even have a Pellegrino here in the, in the bathroom, so these are basically complementary. If you get one of the suites, here's a small bathtub. And of course we have a rather basic toilet over here. And this must be like the original decor of the hotel, because you can see that they probably run away to the other, other places. I mean, like other <coughs> form. But uh, bathroom is so, usually so expensive to fix in the hotel that they try to change this as little as possible. So here we have a a uh, walk-in closet and of course there's the uh, in-room safe which I probably should use more often and here's the uh, here's the guest bathroom of course and I really do like the really like the living room over here um, some local art or whatever um, so here the work desk of course we have a Bose entertainment system over here and there's actually a couple of books one about Mandela something else. Here we have a Bang & Olufsen TV. Um, yeah, I, I had a in-room dining order last night. was too tired to go out to eat. Um, so, very nice sofa setup. And instead of actually using the work desk over there, I used this one like a dining table for, for work basically. They had a pretty nice um, food amenity as well. I ate the crepes and then there's some feminine crepes that didn't drink. I did have to ask a uh, to bring me one of these power power stuff because they use these really weird um, ones here in South South Africa. That's I think that's the only only one that I don't have adapters for. And of course we have an espresso machine, um, some ice. Um, only had a iPad. <laughs> I mean, this is all complimentary, basically. I only had the iced tea and an orange juice for the maple yesterday. Left all the other stuff untouched. There's the glassware. And they do have a pretty nice setup of um, tea and coffee over here. A lot of Nespresso capsules. And, uh, of course, there's teas and chocolate as well. So, um, I was actually at the same hotel first, like, maybe 10 years ago. And uh, um, at that time, I only got a regular club rule. So I don't know if this is their, their new um, Royal Ambassador upgrade to give you both the club and the suite, or, um, or if there's something else. But I had to say that I was very satisfied. I might be back here tomorrow night, we'll see. So again, this is the uh, Intercontinental Hotel in Santon, uh, Johannesburg, South Africa and this is the um, uh, Intercontinental Deluxe Suite 1956 and one more thing, this is actually attached to a very popular mall over here <laughs> that are very popular actually so uh, you can just go to the 10th floor and use a you know walkway to go to the mall directly from the hotel so you don't even have to go outside if you don't want to